everybody, this is uh, Marte Saint with Descendo Decimus. I'm here to show you a burst damage loadout for the T6 alert, survival mode, and uh, T5 raids. First things first, let's take a look at your uh, your powers. Your iconic powers I'm going to do first, just because a lot of times people forget those. Uh, you're going to get the obvious tactical genius and weapons expert, and then the uh, robot sidekick. And then going into the voltage tree, you're going to go all the way down the left and get the 35 percenter, and go down the middle just to wired. And then you're going to get megavolt. Wired is going to be your buff for your weapon and also electrifies enemies. And then the supercharge is going to be a large AOE. And then this, the 35 percenter is a single target. And then going into the amperage tree. You're basically all you're going to want out of here is a tract and static push. And I also I have that extra power point left over, so I grab invigorate just to help out in survival mode with power and healing over time if uh, the healer goes down or the trolls are struggling. And in your loadout, the first thing is going to be wired. You're going to go attract, static push, iconic drain, uh, invigorate and robot sidekick and like I said this invigorate you can substitute it with with megavolt depending on what situation you're in if you're in the T6 alert I always just go with megavolt and then if I'm doing survival mode I do uh, I'm gonna go with the invigorate like I said to help out the trolls and the healers and everything if there's a bit of a struggle where everybody's trying to do pickups it's always nice to have a DPS that can be able to help out as much as possible And the rotation is going to be fairly simple. Just try to always remember to have your sidekick out if it goes down or it gets killed. And to start out, I always do my, my trinket and draw my supply drop. And then you're going to clip your power interaction with your buff. And then just go straight into your weapon mastery with static push. And static push is going to be your, your major burst damage along with your weapon mastery. And as you can see here on a single target, it hits fairly hard. And here in just a minute, I'll show you what it does on a uh, on multiple targets. I'll walk to the watchtower so you can see that. There really, really is not going to be a whole lot of difference. Sometimes you will get a little bit of a split depending on how many ads there are. But if there's only two to three, you'll you'll normally get the same amount of damage. And then bosses, you know, normally there's only two bosses at a time, so you're really not losing any damage any damage there. And also, if you weapon mastery into your power interaction, that's also going to be an area of effect power. So you're hitting multiple targets with it, and it also hardly has any split. So it's always a good thing to weapon mastery combo into that when you clip into your, your buff. And that'll be it here on the single target. I'm going to warp to the watchtower and show you what it does there on the, both targets. Alright guys, I'm back here in the watchtower. I'm going to show you the multi-target damage. As you can see there, I'm getting a split, but it's not really splitting the damage at all. You're still getting the 4,000 and 3,000, 2,000 crits. Like I said, it will it will start to vary just a little bit whenever you get to uh, get to somewhere like in the T6 alert where you have anywhere from 10 to 15 ads at a time and you you're hitting them all at once. It will split a little bit, but you'll still get the you'll still get a thousand to three thousand as long as you got that weapon mastery combo. And you can as well with your 35 percent, as you see here. You can weapon mastery combo into it, and it hits hard as well, but it's also just a single target. And you don't have to worry about any power interactions with it. And as you just seen, I'll do it here again. Your power interaction is also going to be a multi-target and AOE. So that's that's pretty much it uh, there's not much to it 
just keep your power interaction up and weapon mastery combo into your static push. If you guys have any questions, feel free to hit me up on DC or in the comments. You guys took the time to to watch my video, so just to give back, I can answer any questions or group up with you and walk you through the loadout if you have any more questions on how to get the rotation down or if you're just not getting the damage damage shown here, figure out what the problem is. And, uh, special thanks to Unforgiven for keeping my power level up while I'm doing this rotation here for you guys. I will be posting two more loadouts. I have a loadout for PvP arenas and a loadout for AoEs and DOTs. So they should be up shortly. They'll be on my uh, channel here on YouTube and also on my Twitch channel. So feel free to take a look at those and I can also answer any questions about those when they come up. So once again, thank you guys and thanks Unforgiven. Until next time.